Welcome to The P Word. I'm your host, LaFrida Smith. And thank you so much for tuning in to episode four of Welcome to College. Yes, 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 yes. I never told you guys that I, myself, along with my three children, were all in college. Yes, I decided to go back to college this past January to get my bachelor's in communication. I previously went to uh, back to college in, um, two, I think it was 2013, to get my associates in business management. And this was all while I was working a 60, 70 hour, 60 to 70 hour a week job. It was tough. Working full time and doing online was tough, but I made it work. I did it. I got my degree from University of Phoenix. Now I'm attending Kaiser University where I'm doing a whole lot in the community. Um, I love my coursework. Um, it's a, a accelerated classes because I'm only doing a year and a half. Um, that's all I need to get my bachelor's. So each class is like four weeks. So between midterms, finals, assignments, essays, and you know, you name it, we got it. And it's just, it's been a lot to juggle, but you know what? I am doing well. And I, you know, and I, you know, not a lot of people can say that at 44 years old, that they're doing well with juggling something that most people would think that younger people would be able to handle. But I'm finding that my three adults, they have just as much trouble with college as I do. And, you know, like, say, for example, my my oldest, he tells me he's like, I am so, uh, you know, worried about what my final grade is going to be because I had this test. I had this test and this assignment and this assignment. And I don't know if I passed or not. And now all of a sudden they're saying that a D is passing. When did that happen? Really? So, um. So he did get some news. He said his last, that's a two minute warning. Um, so he did get some news that this last class that he got, he got a C. So he passed. So yeah, so he'll be graduating this year. Uh, I think it's going to be in August or September or something like that. But, um, you know, we look forward to having another celebration dinner like we did um, with Mr. Baker Devon. Uh, we're so proud of him. So, um, you know, my daughter, she she's at Southeastern. And she's got another three years left. But, um, you know, I'm so excited to to have. I was so excited when they all graduated from high school. Oh, that day was uh, 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 momentous for me. Uh, my daughter was the last to graduate. And I was like, oh, my God, my baby is the last to graduate. Oh, my gosh. But um, going going through this with them, you know, going to college with them and experiencing everything that they're experiencing, um, it's just, you know, I feel so close to them. Um, and, you know, I appreciate all the support that they give me. And, you know, I'm just so happy to be able to do what I want to do in my second half of my life. And college, having a college experience is one of them. I didn't get to do that when I was younger. So, uh, but if you guys are not following me already, um, my links are linktree slash author LaFrida or www.lafridasmith.com. Um, I'm a speaker, author, mentor, and autism advocate. So I do a lot of speaking engagements and Hopefully at my college, I'll be able to do a lot of uh, speaking events and such and get um, into student uh, to talk with students. Um, so tune in next week.